Okay, so now we're going to draw a cupcake. It's going to be part of our cupcake collection. And so now, um, we had a suggestion, and Simone's going to be telling a joke um, at the very front of our video. So, go, Simone. Um, so, knock, knock. Who's there? Interrupted cow. Interrupted Moo. cow. Wow. Moo. <laughs> okay. 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 We're not gonna draw a cow. We're drawing a cupcake. I want to be awesome. Maybe, maybe you can draw a cow cake. Oh. You should so do that. Okay. So now we're going to do our adorable cupcake. But but it, it kind of sounds weird. Cow cake. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. We're not making like a hamburger cow cake thing. Okay. Hamburger. That went way too far. Cause you know hamburgers are made out of cows. No. You know what? Let's get. Okay. 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 Guys. Let's just do it. Okay. Okay, Sorry so now about all the we're going to make a horizontal line like that. Okay, we're doing it parallel. <laughs> so, I meant parallel. Portrait. <laughs> oh, and um, make sure you have a, um, a paper under because it bleeds. And so I'm just using the, the, um, the paper from our cat drawing because it had blood through. If like that. you saw the cat drawing. Yeah, if you had seen the cat. Okay, so anyways, we're going to continue. Put your paper back down. Make that line. I'm gonna put mine a little bit longer. Like that. Okay, now we're gonna do it again. A little kinda next to it. Well not too next. And then you're gonna make a line. Straight down. Okay, so now we're going to do a contour line. Like that. Mine's fat. I don't call it fat. No okay. cupcakes being a thin no. <laughs> no, look at it. Oh, come on. That's not that bad. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to do this. We're going to do like that. And then we're going to go like that. And we're going to go like that. So we're going to make like a big line here and make small lines on the side. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to make a larger, a large line on this side again. And we're going to do the same thing on this side. And we're going to do it one more time, and it's going to go kind of in the middle. Like I'm that. still watching. And then for this one, we're going to do a big line like that. Okay. So first, we're going to do a squiggly line into the bottom. You're not even up. Okay. Faster, lady. Faster. Remember that big hook line. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to do the squiggly line there. Okay, so now we're going to do a squiggly line from this one to the next one like that. And this is going to be the frosting on the top. I thought you said... Okay. Whipped cream frosting. Whipped cream. Okay, and then we're going Whatever to go you down it. and we're going to come up again and we're going to go in like that. Now this one's going to be a little bit different. We're going to come in... We're going to go like that, but then we're going to curl around the side and meet up with that. So that kind of has like this curve thing on the top. Okay, there you go. Okay, so now we're going to draw sprinkles. Because awesome. a cupcake isn't a cupcake, it's not sprinkles. So we're going to do ovals because they're going to be fat sprinkles. And we're going to do it all around the cupcake. Kind of I'm doing like kind of spread out. Oh, my spread out. Kind of. You can do small ones, big ones, sideways, different directions, upside down. Technically, and a little upside down. Any way you put it. Cause you have to like. Not any way you put it. Okay, fine. Okay. Not finished. That's kind of like a pattern right there. Oh, yeah, huh? Maybe you can do like dots if you wanted. But like. You can put like. Like how you can did put bubbles on the, the cat's tank. You can, you can do like little bubble shaped things. Um, sprinkles. Oh my gosh, we said at the same time. Okay, so now we are going to draw that ice. So we're going to draw a big circle. I bet 
one corner. And we're going to draw another circle that is. on the other side. Okay. And then we're going to draw a line across like that. What is that? It's going to be in the house. And we're going to draw a big line like that. I know, you don't usually see indeed. a cupcake smiling. And then you're going to go well, like that. You're going to make a little moon shape. Well, it's on the probably corner. because it doesn't want to be in. And you're going to do that over there. Kind of like that. It's probably because it doesn't want to be eaten. Probably. So. Okay, so then we're going to do a big circle and then a medium circle under it. Like that. Like a, a big almost like a circle figure. and a medium circle. It's like, it's like a circle. figure like that. eight. Yeah, it's like a figure eight. Like, but like, like it's space. Apart. Yeah, like tear apart. Okay, so now we're going to color it in. But don't color in the dots. Yeah, don't do that because those are the light catchers. And then it won't look like I don't think it will look just like an evil. It looked like some evil possessed villain. cupcake. Evil, an evil possessed cupcake. Yes. There you go. Evil. There's our little cupcake. Cute. It's so cute. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're gonna draw the lines for the um, the paper around the cupcake. So we're gonna do a line like that, and we're gonna do a line like that. Make sure it kind of goes through. We do it over here, kind of like right down the middle. That one kind of looks like a nose. Okay, and so, so there we go. We have all of our lines. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and, and and so we'll do something a little different. We'll go, we'll go like that, and then we'll do the same thing on the other side, and just have it extend out like that. Oh, like a little plate. Yeah. But it's not going to be a plate. It's going to be something else. So we're going to do a big circle. Not a circle. Like that. We're going to go like that. And then we're going to do, we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to get smaller as we get down. And then by the time we get down, we're going to go like that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we're going to do the bottom like that. But then it looked like it was floating. <coughs> and so now <coughs> we're going to do a little swirly <coughs> that problem. We're going to do little swirlies. Um, make it look like a little stand. Okay, and then we're going to see cupcakes for sale out of that. You could do that. And make it look like it's sparkly. Make little sparkle lines. Like that. And maybe you could do something like that. Like, like diamonds. Yeah, diamonds. Right? Not very diamonds. good at diamonds, but <laughs> that's all I got. There. Like little tiny dots everywhere. Oh yeah, you could totally do that too. Just to jazz it up a little bit, I'm going to do it like BAM! Bam. Okay. So now we have our sparkly little stand. Now we're gonna do to make the top thicker, we're gonna go like that. We're gonna go like that. Maybe we can do you can go like that. You can go like cup. Now you don't have to do any of this, you can just draw the cupcake. But yeah. Okay. Come on, son. You can do this. You can just do a little four. Like the number four. Hold on. There you. There we go. Okay. So this is our cupcake, and it's going to be part of our cupcake series. We're going to have multiple cupcakes. They're all going to be cute and adorable. And if you go to the color link, which I had mentioned in our other videos, um, if we're going to be showing how to color this adorable cupcake. Oh, you colored that in. Yeah. Oh, you should well, do that too. Okay. Yeah.